<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, it's your girl, Simply Ty. And if you're watching this video, you already know it's time for tray number number nine, nine, whatever I want to say it. It's time for tray nine. For this video, I will be posting um side by side pictures of tray seven to tray uh nine so it's gonna be at the end of the video so you can jump to the end of the video or you can watch it all the way to the end choices yours but um recap for tray eight i'm not even gonna lie for the first three days like i always say it is tough but this time it was hard because i had headaches like for three days straight and it was to the point where I was just like, I don't know if that's normal. I had to hit up my advisor. Like, um, I was like, yo, I'm feeling these headaches, like, right in the frontal lobe area. Is this normal? And I know going in with Smart Direct, it's not like Invisalign, in which you are actually, uh, you know, set up with your orthodontist and they walk you through it. Although with Invisalign, I know I read that they also you do experience headaches, but I just wanted to make sure that my teeth is okay because sometimes they say um, headaches are related to teeth pain, tooth pain. So I just wanted to make sure that there was no nerve damage or me just hurting my teeth. But she said that it is completely normal and after like the third day it did fade away so i was like relieved because i i didn't want to wig out i didn't want to like you know go crazy but um yeah i don't like that i just don't like that like that that shit is that is not that nah i can't and it makes me kind of discourage me a little bit just because if i have to go through that again like seriously Oh my gosh, I just don't wanna I just don't wanna go through that. I just don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do it. But um no pain no gain, right? That's what they say. No pain no gain. I guess I'm gonna do it. But yeah, um But yeah, you know, it's time for tray number nine. And I'm ready. I'm not gonna stop. I feel like I'm I'm not a quitter and I see through to the end. So let's just uh move on and without further ado let's go to the bathroom it's bathroom time <laughs> all right so we in the bathroom now let's get straight into it it's time for train <laughs> it's time for train that um, yeah, let me take my teeth out, sorry, gotta take it out, Karen, okay. got my toothbrush, oh guys, look what I did, this is so ghetto of me, but I don't really care, um, if you'd ever decide to get Smile Direct, there's these things that they uh, give you called Chewies, and the Chewy is supposed to help adjust uh the trays into your mouth more proper like it's supposed to help the trays fit to your teeth better but like i lost them and i realized that the back of my toothbrush was kind of like the same material as my chewy so i literally cut off the back of my toothbrush <laughs> like a piece of it see it fits perfect like these but I cut off the back a piece of it and I actually use this as my substitute chewy. So just in case you lose your chewy and you don't know what to do and you don't want to pay for another one, you can get an Oral-B toothbrush or whatever toothbrush that has that nice gummy fit in part to it. And you could just take that off or cut it off or saw it off, whatever you want to do, and it will fit. So yeah. But love. She got a thing with never more money. Hey, hey. Let's get into it. Like I always use my charcoal um, fluoride free 
toothpaste. It does magic. It's like magic. And it actually helps my teeth get wider in between my uh, whitening sessions. Um, but yeah, let's just get into it. So I know the hard time you guys don't probably see me on camera flossing my teeth and I like wonder like, is this bitch? You can keep it up her routine. Actually, I am. So off camera, before I go to bed, I would definitely uh floss and then go through my teeth. So I floss every day. It's good to floss twice a day. But I am keeping up with my teeth routine so well that um yeah, like and I noticed that since my teeth are actually like closing up and the gaps are um. The gaps are getting smaller in between my teeth that I don't like food is not getting stuck in them as they used to and that's a good thing not a bad thing um also I will include this in also in every um video in the description link below these uh licorice sticks guys seriously um Just because I, I will never stop talking about this because this is so good for overall oral health. Like these sticks literally are good for cleaning your teeth, getting lightening the stains. I mean, even though you can use the whitening uh, strips and those help, but this combined with this prevent like gum disease, uh, receding gums, you know, cavities, just stuff like that. That from you know poor eating habits candy and all that stuff that you know tastes so good but it's just like not good for your teeth overall drinking wine and stuff like that this licorice root stick literally helps like i would chew on this every day in between uh times when i'm eating or like when i take out my trays just for like just the juices to get into my teeth and I will tell you overall, the strength of my teeth, the health of my teeth have just been like amazing. And I'm getting, I'm getting so used to them. I, I'll, I like chewing them and then I'll suck out like the, the juices out of it just so it gets in my teeth. That's a very ritual thing that I do. But these are so good. You guys have to get this licorice root sticks. I'm gonna include it in the description below. But definitely invest in this. Like, amazing. Mm. Mm -mm. What I first would do, you know what I came here to do. It's time for tray number nine. As usual, you know, let me put this one back in the bag. Let me wash these out. I like to wash my old trays before I put them away because, um, you know, just in case you lose it, you want to just, you know, keep them clean. They were riding with you for two weeks. You don't want to, like, oh, gee, like, come on now. That's messed up. You don't want to do that. Treat, treat them with care. Make sure that they, they know that you appreciate them. Thank you, Trey 8. It's been it's been good. You riding with me. Although you gave me headaches and I don't even like that. Like now I'm kinda scared. I'm scared what Trey 9 gonna do because Trey 8 really gave me a headache. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Guys. I feel like a little headache coming on just because I'm thinking about it. Alright. Don't be a pissy. Come on, Tysha, let's go. <laughs> All right, so tray nine. Let's go.
Uh huh, guys. Tray nine. And the front teeth. I feel it. But um, I don't have lost mine, so okay. All right, snug, but not bad. Snug, but not bad. Um, the bottom. I already know how, but I but I say so I ain't even gonna say no more. This is getting too good. Make sure you're giving this video a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you have any questions, guys, please don't be afraid to ask. I will do my best to answer. Until next time, I'm going to see you in the next <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next two weeks. It's peace. It's love. And I'll see you. Uh -huh.